Okay, so I'm in the game against Kevin R.A. Um, he usually uses Hog Earthquake, so it'll be really hard to win. Um, I'm not really sure what he's playing, actually. He has a Goblin Cage. Not really used in Hog very often, so I guess I'm just going to play safe until I figure out what he has. I'm just going to Princess the back. Pretty safe play when he has a cage down. Um, I'm just going to Guards. I don't want to really be leaking too much Elixir. He's in the Earthquake. Um... Oh no, he's playing Royal Hog Earthquake. This is like the m most hard matchup in the game, like the hardest matchup in the entire game. He has literally 100 0. Um, this is like impossible to win, so I'm probably going to lose. And he's so much below me, I'm probably going to get a minus 44. Um, uh, I'm not really looking forward for this. I'm going to go for a high Inferno and guards just to kill the rest of the hogs. Um, I did outcycle his log, but I don't even know if I want to go in. Probably not. Eh. He was going to scale East or Fire Spirit, but I don't really want to waste my East Spirit. Um, I might go East Spirit Goblin Barrel, but... Oh, wait, no. He used Royal Delivery on my Goblin Barrel, so he definitely has the log. I wasn't really thinking. Um, I'm going to Princess the back into the Queen, as always. Um, it's going to Valkyrie on top as well. If he wants to Pigs, I can Rocket them, so I'm not really worried about it. Gonna Valkyrie. He has to respond to this princess still. He's gonna log. Um, I'm gonna go Goblin Barrel right now. He's gonna Royal Delivery for no damage again, but I just can't really get any damage, and he just cycles me out. As you can see, this is why like this is like an impossible matchup to win. I'm gonna go High Inferno again. Good Earthquake. I'm gonna Guards as well. Shouldn't take much, much or any damage, I don't think. Uh, yeah, no damage. Good defense. I'm just gonna princess a little bit higher this time. Snipe that archer queen. I'm gonna barrel right now. Um, maybe he messed up his real delivery. I'm just gonna Valklo log and E Spirit to left, guards the queen, and just eat this damage. Um, this is not good. Um, I don't think I can actually win. Like, I'm down 700 damage. Just nothing I can really do, unfortunately. Um, I'm gonna go for a Valkyrie on the right, Log on the left, E Spirit as well for no Goblin Cage hits, hopefully. Okay. Um, this is a rocket on the tower. I have to take this. Um, it's always fine to rocket when they use their queen as long as you're not down, and in this instance, I'm up. Um, I'm gonna Princess to finish that queen. He's gonna have to pop ability early, so that's good. Earthquake. I'm just going to log just in case the abilities. Oh, I got a goblin hit there, so that's really nice. Still down 600. Um, I'm going to guards in front. Really bad real hard. So I'm going to go Valak and East spirit oh, I'm going to Goblin Barrel. He doesn't have real delivery right now. Um, I'm going to Princess as well. I should catch him off guard right now. Um, okay. That's princess on tower. Really, really good. Um, he's going to queen the middle. Okay. Um, get it. You get one more shot. Okay. I'm actually at the damage lead now. I'm gonna Valkyrie and then High Inferno. Not really worried about that pig on the left. Um, this queen should be dead. He's gonna go for another set of pigs, probably. He's already back. Um, I'm, gonna, Let's go. I'm gonna hold my log out because he might go for a. Okay, I'm gonna Goblin Barrel right now. He did use his log. I'm gonna Valkyrie and then log the left. Then just rocket the tower again because I'm up Elixir, but. My tower is pretty weak. I'm gonna princess just a, a, a little bit up. I'm gonna Goblin Barrel right away because I think he's gonna waste his log. Um, he does waste his log. Real delivery. Oh, okay. He does full counter our Goblin Barrel again. Um, I'm gonna guards and Valklo. Princess E Spirit as well because I just can't take any damage. I'm gonna log the tower again. Goblin Barrel right now because he might log. Okay, doesn't log. I need to get some damage. Oh, he messed up! Oh my god, let's go. Oh my god, that's such a bad matchup. Let's go. Can't believe I won that. Um, plus 15 trophies. Number 18. I'm in a game against this um, Japanese guy. He plays Prince Logbait. He's pretty good at the deck as well, but I have a really good matchup here, so I shouldn't lose unless I play really badly. I'm just going to E-Spear at the back, and then I'm going to Princess into his Princess. And then I'm going to go Valkyrie at the bridge to keep my Princess alive and kill his, and then just go Guards on his Dark Goblin. 
Um, a good tip in this matchup is if you're good at reading the goblin barrels, you can use your log on his like princess, his dark goblin, sometimes his rascals. If you're really good at reading their goblin barrels to full counter it without a log. I'm going to princess right now because he might go. Okay, goes guards. Prince is going to clean up the guards. Um, He's going to princess right now. That's all he has. And I'm going to like get my log ready to log the princess like he's gonna do it right now yep exactly he was gonna wait for it to lock on so he has a counter pushing princess and as you can see my princess survives and gets 800 damage i'm just gonna guards on this dark goblin um i'm just gonna hold my valkyrie behind my tower to full counter the goblin barrel this is a really good tip guards gonna get some chip too didn't really have a good hand to defend that already up 1600 damage this is a really good start um i'm just gonna hold my valk see what he wants to do Okay, that's going to get no hits. Um, You have to be fast with it, or else it will get hits. But if you're really fast with it, then it won't get any damage. Then as well, you really want to protect your princesses in this matchup, because all he has to kill it is log, but he needs to use it on the goblin barrel. Same with him. I can't really kill his princess unless I log it. But I, I can get away with logs more freely than he can. Um, I'm just going to go E-Spirit here, guards low, and then Valkyrie on top. I have a pretty good counter push here. Um... He's going to see what he wants to do. Probably going to... Okay. Um, I'm just going to go for a tricky barrel. Maybe he misses. Um, princess is going to kill that Dark Goblin. Good guards by my opponent. I'm going to Princess again. Maybe he'll log this one. Because he did just counter my barrel without a log. Um, I'm going to do this. This is a really good tip as well. If they have a Princess in the front, you can log the two Goblins and then defend the back one to kill the Princess as well. It's a really good tip. Because you get a lot of value out of your log and you still don't take any damage as seen right there. I'm just going to go guards on the right. Um, I'm just going to go E-Spirit as well just to make sure I don't take any damage. Um, I'm going to Valk the bridge. He can counter this with Rascals maybe, but it's not the end of the world. Okay, he does go Prince. I'm going to go Princess in the middle again. Goblin Barrel on the side. If he sees this, he'll go guards. Okay, really well played from him. He read my barrel, so he went guards. And then he logged my princess. I'm going to go Valkyrie right here. Just to kill these rascals. It won't kill the guards because they have a further range in the Valkyrie. But it is okay. I'm going to let this Dark Goblin connect completely and just go for a Goblin Barrel. Because he doesn't have a rocket. I mean a log or a guard. So that's going to get a lot of damage. I'm just going to take this log value right here I think. And then I'm going to guards on the prince. That, that That's in the front. So I'm just going to guards quickly. And then Valkyrie to protect princess. That's what I was saying with the you need to be good at seeing the barrels when you use the log. Or else that would have gotten damage. Um, I'm going to go Goblin Barrel in the back. Protect this Princess with an E-Spirit. Oh, he does miss one. So I do get one stab. I'm going to go Guards in front of the Prince. And then... I'm just going to let this go. Um, I think I'm going to log that Princess. And then Princess again in the back. And then that's on the right side. So I'm just going to Valkyrie the right side. For no damage again. I'm going to go for an Inferno Tower hide just to snipe that Prince. And then I'm going to E-Spirit over here. He might Dark Goblin. Okay. Rascals. Princess plus E-Spirit one-shots Rascal Girls. So that's a good tip to know as well. I'm going to Valkyrie this Dark Goblin and then just guards over on the side. E-Spirit as well. Princess. No, I'm going to Inferno. I'm going to Goblin Barrel. And Princess low again. I do get a stab there. I don't see any way he could win. Um, I'm just going to log to kill these rascal girls. And then, oh, this is a good push from him. Um, I'm going to go Valkyrie. Goblin Barrel in the back because his Goblin Barrel is in the back. And then quickly Princess. Okay, so I'm not going to take any damage here again. Um, just can't stress it enough. Just being really, really good on seeing the Goblin Barrel. So you don't take any damage. Um, I'm going to Valkyrie. This is going to full counter the barrel. E-Spirit, Distract Princess, log it. GG. I'd say that was a flawless game, in my opinion. I played really well. He just couldn't do anything to get through. I mean, um, I did lose a few games before this one, so I'm not going to be as high as I was last time, but I'm going to try to finish top 20 in this video. I'm in the game against him. This guy is really, really bad. Um, lava first play. 
I'm gonna get a lot of damage, but this is gonna be a tricky defense since I'm down four elixir since he just ignored the e-spirit goblin barrel. Let's go. Um, I'm gonna inferno power on the left, princess the right. Tricky and easy defense. Um, I might take a little bit of damage because I'm down a lot of elixir. So he's gonna scale you back to This is a really tough matchup because he does have the lightning. Not really what I'm looking for. I don't really like this the lightning. He's gonna balloon the bridge at 5 because he expected me to guards this mega minion. But I'm not gonna guards because then I wouldn't be able to afford anything for the balloon. Right off the bat. Lose my tower to that. Um. His hand right now is like lightning, lava, arrows, and tombstone. So I'm just going to guard the bridge. He has a really awkward hand for this. He has to tombstone because there's no way he arrows. I'm going to go guard right now. He's going to tombstone. Um, now he has mega minion in hand. So lava, mega minion, lightning, arrows. I'm just going to goblin barrel. He might ignore this in lava, but I'm, I don't like this position. I'm just... So I should be able to defend, but maybe it could get a little bit awkward. I'm gonna hide Inferno because he does have lightning, but if he lightnings, he won't be able to support some kind of kind of beta lightning. I'm gonna put this stuff to the side so I can get one shot before he does his arrow. There's a lot of this. Okay, I'm gonna push for Valkyrie. That Valkyrie placement, so he should get the shot for him. I thought maybe he would lightning to get the power, but he did. So, in the E-Spirit, need to Valkyrie in front, I think. So he's gonna go for Skelly Drag and Mega Minion. Um, I'm just gonna, I guess I have to grab the barrel here. So princess clean up, I guess. This is not a good spot right now. Power trade versus lava. Oh my god, it's back to their lava hat. It's a lava hat. I'm gonna guard. Back a little bit long. It's a cycle to rock it. Um, I'm down about half a tower compared to him. My king's really low as well. I don't really see myself winning this. I'm gonna go goblin barrel and then guards in the pocket because he doesn't have like his arrows in the guards. So he does lob at the same time, so maybe I can put this card. You can ignore the whole thing, just build up the big push. I'm trying to screw here unless he makes a huge mistake. I'm gonna try to get him to arrows this princess so I can go Valkyrie goblin barrel in the pocket, maybe try to cheese to win. I'm gonna go inferno with this up here. Distract and kill the mega minion. I'm gonna quickly rocket this over here. Um, my arrows right now. Just over there, he's gonna push a lot. Princess by my king. I think he's gonna arrow, so I'm gonna quickly get ready to go Goblin Barrel Valkyrie. Okay, I'm gonna go now. And I, 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 he does mega minion. He actually can't defend. All he has is so There's no way for him to defend this. I think he won. Oh my god. I'm gonna BM this guy because I don't really like him and he always BMs everybody. <laughs> okay, so I'm in the next game against DJ Dam. Um, not sure what this guy runs. The Inferno Dragon in the back. I'm just gonna princess opposite lane of that. Um, I'm gonna go Goblin Barrel. Okay, I'm gonna go Eastbrook Goblin Barrel the left. I'm not going to spirit. I'm just going to use the Valkyrie to um, kite this back and force out a response. Seems like a weird deck. Um, which as well. Hmm. I don't know what this guy has. I'm kind of confused right now. Um, maybe looking like a balloon deck or like a Mega Knight deck. I don't know. Maybe Mega Knight and balloon. Um, I'm just going to log e spirit to switch. I'm not going to take any damage there. Um, so far he showed fireball, so I'm just gonna goblin barrel. Um, what? Okay, so he has balloon. Um, kind of an interesting balloon. Um, he, oh, fireball zap as he spells. Um, I'm gonna rocket this balloon right now, just to be safe. 
Don't really want to use Inferno Tower when I'm still not sure of what he has. I'm going to Princess opposite lane of this Inferno Dragon once again. Especially because I don't want to go into the left where he has more damage. If he does nothing, I'm probably just going to Guards at the bridge. Okay, Fireball's the Princess. I'm just going to Guards low. These guards should get some chip if he do doesn't do anything. Um, okay, he does go for a witch. Pretty interesting. I'm just going to East Spirit the back. Goblin Barrel the tower now because the witch is not going to be in range of the Goblin Barrel. Um, Lumberjack. I'm just going to log this. Then go for a Lumberjack. Okay, interesting. Um, I'm going to Valkyrie and then Inferno Tower. In this matchup, um, he has Fireball Zap, so if he Fireballs the Princess, Electro Spirit Goblin Bill will be really good because Zap won't really do anything since it's being tanked by the E Spirit. So try to be okay. I'm gonna go Valkyrie on the left, guards over here to hit the Mega Knight and kite the Inferno Dragon away from the Princess. Really good play there. Um, so I have a counter push now. He has to defend this with probably a Witch. Yeah, I'm gonna Princess on the left, even though it's my lower tower. He still has to defend the right one, so. He does Fireball. I'm going to go Goblin Barrel since he doesn't have Fireball. I would go East Spirit, but the Witch is obviously blocking. I'm just going to log East Spirit the Witch. Um, I'm going to pre-plant my Inferno. And then I'm going to Princess this Inferno Dragon. Just putting it here so we can't Fireball the Inferno Tower and the Princess. I'm going to go Goblin Barrel while defending because he doesn't have enough Elixir to defend the Goblin Barrel. And that should be game. I'm going to Rocket the Tower. GG. Always make sure to pressure while defending if you know you can get away with it. Like, as you can see there, I could definitely defend still if I didn't throw that rocket. Um, pretty nice game. I'm going to check what I'm at. Um, my rank hasn't updated yet. I'm going to check one more time. Um, number 18. Let's go.